everybody. Uh, do you ever do something that makes you feel like such a complete fucking idiot? That you want to just run and hide underneath your covers? Yeah, that's what I just thought. So, earlier today I was doing this and I was like, cool, you know, I got an hour's worth of gameplay done. So, that didn't happen. I had got an hour's worth of voice recording done, but when I went to preview my setup and make sure that everything was running smoothly, I never stopped previewing it and I never actually started recording it. So I thought I'd share that with you guys and everybody who's watching, you know, because nobody's perfect. And I figured, well, this would be a good chance to just really run through the basics. And um, I'm only going to be... I don't know. I I just... I'm just going to play. Welcome to the Circle Stockroom of Magical Items. My name is Owain. How may I assist you? Rods of fire serve many purposes. Why do you wish to acquire this particular item? Here is the form, Request for Rod of Fire. Have it signed and dated by a senior enchanter. I will release a rod to you once I have the signed form. Thank you. Thank you, Elwain. Well, I guess we're gonna go back to the lady who owes us a favor. I actually did something very bad the first time. I accidentally told on Joe Wayne and um, Lily. I told on them to the first enchanter Irving and I really didn't want to do that. I felt so bad that I had tattled. So I'm just gonna look for that lady and get her to sign, I think. Oh, she's right there. Okay. It's good to see you again. A rod of fire? Yeah. Hmm. Oh, sure, I could sign that. What would it hurt? Right. <laughs> there that you go. Damn How's thing. that? It was a pleasure. You'll go far in the circle, I bet. <laughs> oh, so far. So far. You don't even know. Alright, let's get going. Welcome to the Circle wrong. Stockroom of Magical Items. My name is Owain. How may I assist you? Everything looks to be in order. Here is the rod you requested. Hey, I think I actually got... Ooh, I'm going to avoid that. I do not want to go see him. I want to just be super sneaky, super snoop. That is not how you get out of here. I can't follow these maps for shit. Like, what's that do? I just want to get to the chapel. Oh, that was the chapel. Already click all these things. Yeah, getting the experience. I hate waiting. It makes me nervous. That was quick. To the repository then. Freedom awaits. Alright, let's go guys. Get my dirt pad on. We're gonna go to the repository. No fooling around this time. I know exactly what I need to do, how I need to do it. I'm just so aggravated with myself. I can't believe I did that. But we're on a mission, so we're gonna get through this.
more cutscenes, yay, and it's gonna take forever. So frustrated, I can't believe I did that. You, you guys, you guys don't even know how frustrated I am. The Chantry calls this entrance the Victim's Door. It is built of 277 blanks, one for each original Templar. It is a reminder of all the dangers those cursed with magic pose. The doors can be opened only by a Templar and a mage entering together. The Chantry provides the password which primes the ward, and the mage touches it with mana to release it. First the password. Sword of the Maker, Tears of the Fae. Password only primes the door. Now it must feel the touch of mana. Any spell will do, but hurry. So I must touch it. I'm gonna touch it. I'm gonna touch the butt. Touch it. <gasps> she touched the butt. Do you have the rod with you? Melt the locks off. What's the matter? Why isn't it working? Lily, something's not right. I can't cast spells here. Nothing works. These wards carved into the stone. This must be the Templar's work. You're so wise. They negate any magic cast within this area. I should have guessed. Why would Gregor and Irving use simple keys for such a door? Because magical keys don't work. How do you keep mages away from something? Make their powers completely worthless. That's it then. We're finished. We can't get in. I don't know. Do you think it's another way in? That door probably leads to another part of the repository. What are the chances of there being another entrance? No. I'll take any chance I can get. We can't get into the chamber the way we planned, but we're not about to give up. We can see where this door leads, but I don't think it'll be easy. It looks locked for one. Let's hurry, we've wasted enough time. You're the one talking, my girl. I'm they not giving up, time. we've come too far. Oh, that's not good. Well off. Don't like this. Hmm. Well, that was nice. You don't have anything on you? That sucks. Alright, let's go. Saving the game. Just keep going. Wasting a lot of time in here. There's nothing I really need. adorable. I stepped in on many stills out blood. How delightful! Not a 
the mega. <laughs> I will admit, she is a very cute maid. She's, she loves blood and she loves gore. Ugh, her combat dialogue is the best. Like, there's no. to move this over here. I keep hitting it. So it's no. Let's keep going. Well, that wasn't nice. And so I shall. Ooh, and I have leveled. Lovely. Still came to the rest. Couldn't we all just get along? No, and so I shall. No. Cancel out well, all right. anything. Like if he casts a spell. As you desire. Like when you cast a spell, so it doesn't actually cast it. I'm a squishy little mage. We'll need another way into the phylactery chair. Sure, I did my hair. Let's explore the repository. There's something odd about that statue. Yes, I'd have to agree with you on that. Greetings. Make us breath. Did he just say something? I am the essence and spirit of Eleni Zenovia, once consort and advisor to Archon Valerius. Prophecy my crime, cursed to stone for foretelling the fall of my lord's house. I'm not sure. The Archons were the lords of the Imperium. Forever shall you stand on the threshold of my proud fortress, he said, and tell your lies to all who pass. But my lord found death at the hands of his enemies, and his once proud fortress crumbled to dust, as I foretold. A Deventer statue! Don't listen to it. The Deventer lords dabbled in many forbidden arts. This is a wicked thing. Weep not for me, child. Stone they made me, and stone I am, eternal and unfeeling. And I shall endure till the Maker returns to light their fires again. Come on, Jowen, let's go. Hmm. 
Hmm. Wow, that old. That was interesting. I don't remember that being there. What do you think this does? Why does the Circle keep so many Taventa artifacts in storage? It's history, Lily. And it's fascinating. I've seen pictures of things like this. They amplify any spell cast into them. I bet we could use this to break into the phylactery chamber. See where the mortar might be decaying behind that bookcase? Let's take a closer look. You say so, Derek Shepard. I like how I take my hat off and put it back on after it every It should be pretty easy to get this out of the way. I can't do it on my own. You have to help me. If we work together, we can shift it. Come on. Mm. I don't like your voice or your tone. Use this with the rod. I'm sure it'll work. Hurry, the clock's ticking. This is the phylactery chamber. It... We must find Jowen's phylactery, quickly. Would you destroy yours too if it were here? You still can. I don't think they'd be able to catch you once you're out of here. You'd know how to evade them. You're clever, not like me. Let's just find my phylactery. <laughs> Needy. Couldn't we all just get along? In the game. No. She goes being cute again. That's my phylactery. You found it. I can't believe this tiny vial stands between me and freedom. So fragile. So easy just to be rid of it. To end its hold over me. And I am free. Only apprentice phylacteries are stored in the Circle Tower. This tiny room could not hold the phylacteries of every mage who has passed through the tower doors. Come on, you two. We're done here, and we should leave. I do not want to stay here a moment longer. Head. We yeah, did it! I can't believe it! Thank you. We could never have... So what you said was true. Gregor! An initiate conspiring with a blood man. I'm disappointed, Lily. She seems shocked, but fully in control of her own mind. Not a thrall of the Blood Mage, then. You are right, Irvin. The Initiate has betrayed us. The Chantry will not let this go unpunished. And this one. Newly a mage and already flouting the rules of the Circle. I'm disappointed in you. You could have told me what you knew of this plan, and you didn't. 
You don't care for the mages. You just bow to the Chantry's every whim. Enough! As Knight Commander of the Templars here assembled, I sentence this Blood Mage to death. And this initiate has scorned the Chantry and her vows. Take her to Aenar. The... the Mage's prison? No. Please, no. Not there. No! I won't let you touch her! the maker of blood magic how could you you said you never I, I, I dabbled i thought it would make me a better mage blood magic is evil jowan it corrupts people changes them i'm going to give it up all magic i just want to be with you lily please come with me i trusted you i was ready to sacrifice everything for you i don't know who you are blood mage Stay away from me. Are you all right? Where's Gregor? I knew it. Blood magic. But to overcome so many, I never thought him capable of such power. None of us expected this. Are you all right, Gregor? As good as can be expected given the circumstances. If you had let me act sooner, this would not have happened. Now we have a blood mage on the loose and no way to track him down. Where is the girl? I... I am here, sir. You helped a blood mage. Look at all he's hurt. You've been a friend, but you needn't defend me any longer. Knight Commander, I... I was wrong. I was accomplice to a... A blood mage. I will accept whatever punishment you see fit. Even... Even Aenar. Get her out of my sight. And you. You know why the repository exists. Some artifacts, some magics are locked away for a reason. Did you take anything important from the repository? Very well. I believe you. But your antics have made a mockery of ha. this circle. What are we to do with you? You helped a blood mage escape. All our prevention measures for naught because of you. Knight Commander, if I may, I'm not only looking for mages to join the King's army, I'm also recruiting for the Grey Wardens. Irving spoke highly of this mage, and I would like her to join the Warden ranks. Duncan, this mage has assisted the Malefica and shown no lack of regard for the Circle's rules. She is a danger to all of us. It is a rare person who risks all for a friend in need. I stand by my decision. I will recruit this mage. No! I refuse to let this go unpunished! Rhaegar, mages are needed. This mage is needed. Worse things plague this world than blood mages. You know that. I take this young mage under my wing and bear all responsibility for her actions. A blood mage escapes and his accomplice is not only unpunished, but is rewarded by becoming a Grey Warden. Are our rules nothing? <laughs> Have we lost all authority over our mages? This does not bode well, Irving. Enough. We have no more say in this matter. Yes, be proud, child. You are luckier than you know. You will have ample opportunity to hone your skills, I assure you. Come, your new life awaits. Oh, that was different. But Duncan. We will be traveling it. south through the hinterlands to the ruin of Ostagar on the edges of the Korkari Wilds. 
The Tevinter Imperium built Ostagar long ago to prevent the Wilders from invading the Northern Lowlands. It's fitting we make our stand here, even if we face a different foe within that forest. The King's forces have clashed with the Darkspawn several times, but here is where the bulk of the Horde will show itself. There are only a few Grey Wardens within Ferelden at the moment, but all of us are here. This blight must be stopped, here and now. If it spreads to the north, Ferelden will fall. Ho there, Duncan. King Caelan. I didn't expect a... A royal welcome? I was beginning to worry you'd miss all the fun. Not if I could help it, Your Majesty. Then I'll have the mighty Duncan at my side in battle after all. Glorious. The other wardens told me you'd found a promising recruit. I take it this is she? Allow me to introduce you, Your Majesty. There's no need to be so formal, Duncan. We'll be shedding blood together after all. Ho oh there, friend. Might I know your name? Pleased to meet you. The Grey Wardens are desperate to bolster their numbers, and I, for one, am glad to help them. I understand you hail from the Circle of Magi. I trust you have some spells to help us in the coming battle. Your abilities are still above those of other men. That the Grey Wardens have recruited you says much. Allow me to be the first to welcome you to Ostagar. The Wardens will benefit greatly with you in their ranks. I'm sorry to cut this short, but I should return to my tent. Loghain waits eagerly to bore me with his strategies. Your uncle sends his greetings and reminds you that Redcliffe forces could be here in less than a week. Ha! <laughs> Eamon just wants in on the glory. We've won three battles against these monsters, and tomorrow should be no different. I'm not even sure this is a true blight. There are plenty of darkspawn on the field, but alas, we've seen no sign of an archdemon. Disappointed, Your Majesty? I'd hoped for a war like in the tales. A king riding with the fabled Grey Wardens against a tainted god. But I suppose this will have to do. I must go before Loghain sends out a search party. Farewell, Grey Wardens. What the king said is true. They've won several battles against the Darkspawn here. Despite the victory so far, the Darkspawn horde grows larger with each passing day. By now, they look to outnumber us. I know there is an archdemon behind this, but I cannot ask the king to act solely on my feeling. Yes, we should proceed with the ritual. Feel free to explore the camp here as you wish. All I ask is that you do not leave it for the time being. There is another Grey Warden in the camp by the name of Alistair. When you're ready, seek him out and tell him it's time to summon the other recruits. Until then, I have business I must attend to. You may find me at the Grey Warden tent on the other side of this bridge should you need to. Okay, everybody, I just went around Ostagar and um, sold some things to the quartermaster, exchanged them with very mean words. Um, met a Mambari who drank Darkspawn blood after his owner had been murdered. And now we're just wandering the camp. You there, Elf, what's your name? In the field for our oh, surroundings, it, 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 those it, dogs so. are so. Go wow. tell Sir Loghain that the war party's ready to begin scouting. What? We'll send word if we find anything amiss. Yes, sir. R right away, sir. Oh, I thought he was talking to me. I was like, excuse me? Do you not know who I am? Do not know who I am? I am a Grey Warden recruit who can't master going around a fire pit. Don't you scratch at the floor. Don't you do that, you weird hound coming blood. You know who I am? Do you know who I am? I don't think you do. I don't think you do. I'm a great warden. Anyways. Um. Dog kennels. Infirmary. Oh. 
Okay, so he's all uh, all up there. So I guess I'm gonna join the Grey Wardens now. Because I can't leave until I become a Grey Warden. I'm gonna have to go out into the wilds. Because the dog needs a flower. So I'm get that taken care of. What is it now? Haven't Grey Wardens asked more than enough of the circle? Alright. I simply came to deliver a message from the revered mother, Sir Maid. She desires your presence. What her reverence desires is of no concern to me. I am busy helping the Grey Wardens by the King's orders, I might add. Should I have asked her to write a note? Tell her I will not be harassed in this manner. Yes, I was harassing you by delivering a message. Your glibness does you no credit. Here I thought we were getting along so well. I was even going to name one of my children after you. The Grumpy One. Enough. I will speak to the woman if I must. Get out of my way, fool. <laughs> you know, one good thing about the Blight is how it brings people together. <laughs> You're not the first to tell me that. Wait. We haven't met, have we? I don't suppose you happen to be another mage. Hardly. I just like to know my chances of being turned into a toad at any given moment. Wait, I do know who you are. You're Duncan's new recruit from the Circle of Magi. I should have recognized you right away. I apologize. Did Duncan mention me? Nothing bad, I hope. As the junior member of the order, I'll be accompanying you when you prepare for the joining. Right, that was the name. You know, it just occurred to me that there have never been many women in the Grey Wardens. I wonder why that is. Would that be so terrible? Not that I'm some drooling lecher. Or anything please stop looking at me like that so I'm curious have you ever actually encountered darkspawn before <laughs> when I fought my first one I wasn't prepared for how monstrous it was I can't say I'm looking forward to encountering another anyhow whenever you're ready let's get back to Duncan I imagine he's eager to get things started if you have any questions let me know Otherwise, lead on. All right. Cool. Now we're not the only Grey Warden in the party. Oh, damn it, it's a tutorial. When you're not controlling them, party members act according to your tactics you set. Select Alistair by left-clicking on him or his portrait. Okay. What? So... Is that it? Okay. Let's go. That was annoying. <laughs> I'm getting a lump in my throat, so I might not be able to talk much more after this. Oh god. Did I get myself lost? I think I did. <sighs> but I found some stuff. Oh. Can't even get into it. That's balls. I hear trumpets. I don't think I can get out this way. Nope. Damn, that AI IQ is ridiculously low. You found Alistair, did you? Good. Become I assume a you're warden. ready to begin preparations. Yeah. Assuming, of course, that you're quite finished riling up mages, Alistair. What can I say? The revered mother ambushed me. The way she wields guilt, they should stick her in the army. She forced you to sass the maids, did she? 
We cannot afford to antagonize anyone, Alistair. We don't need to give anyone more ammunition against us. I apologize, Duncan. I'll go collect who we're missing. This is Sir Jory, a knight from Redcliffe. How do you do? And this here is Davos, a fellow from Denerim. Charmed, my lady. And this, of course, is the recruit that Duncan said he was bringing. <laughs> now then, since you're all here, we can begin. You four will be heading into the Kokari Wilds to perform two tasks. The first is to obtain three vials of darkspawn blood, one for each recruit. There was once a Grey Warden archive in the wilds, abandoned long ago when we could no longer afford to maintain such remote outposts. It has recently come to our attention that some scrolls have been left behind, magically sealed to protect them. Alistair, I want you to retrieve these scrolls if you can. The scrolls contain treaties promising support, treaties that may prove valuable in the days to come. Watch over your charges, Alistair. Return quickly and safely. We will. Then may the Mako watch over your path. I will see you when you return. <sighs> I like how my wisp follows me around. I should name him. I wonder what I should name him. Oh goodness, I paused the game. I keep thinking like the space bar is for jumping. I have no idea where we're going. So. Okay. Okay, it's over there. I was like, do we have to go all the way back? In the name of Andraste, I bless you today. May you find favor in the Maker's eyes. Oh, I thought that Sorry, miss. Naked. The army camp is off limits for you right now. Oh, I didn't even want to go over there. So, that's fine. I want to go to the wilds. Let's just over here. Hail. I'm told you all have business in the wilds. The gate's open for you. Just be careful out there. Even a Grey Warden won't be safe in the forest tonight. Cool. So, go to the wilds. Three vials of blood and some scrolls. Doesn't seem too bad. Ugh. <sighs> getting harder to read out my nose. They say it gets worse before you get better. But this little bit my throat. Cute. <sighs> Alright. Onward. Ooh. Something in the head. Is it dark spawn already? Oh, it's a wolf. Either. 
So what they're telling me is I will earn experience even when I don't care that monster Love myself. Me. Only when my party members do. No, you're lovely, Ayara. Where do we need to go? Over here. We don't know. The world is our oyster. <gasps> oh no. Who is that? Grey Wardens? Well, he's not half as dead as he looks, is he? My scouting band was attacked by Darkspawn. They came out of the ground. Please help me. I've got to return to camp. I have bandages in my pack. Thank you. Oh. I... I've got to get out of here. Did you hear? An entire patrol of seasoned men killed by Darkspawn. Calm down, Sir Jory. <laughs> we'll be fine if we're careful. Those soldiers were careful, and they were still overwhelmed. How many Darkspawn can the four of us slay? A dozen? A hundred? There's an entire army in these forests. There are Darkspawn about, but we're in no danger of walking into the bulk of the Horde. How do you know? I'm not a coward, but this is foolish and reckless. We should go back. That's true. Know this. All Grey Wardens can sense Darkspawn. Whatever their cunning, I guarantee they won't take us by surprise. That's why I'm here. You see, Sir Knight, we might die, but we'll be warned about it first. That is reassuring. That doesn't mean I'm here to make this easy, however. <laughs> so let's get a move on. Oh. oh, did we find you? I guess so. in him. It appears we will need to fight the entire blight ourselves. Ooh, swamp. Ooh. 
chopped off his head. That's cool. Oh, there was a dark spawn over there. Well, I'm sorry. How am I supposed to know? Finally, some blood. Looting thing could have been done better. How you loot things? Pretty sure there's a way to like auto loot like a big area. Instead of doing individuals. Super useful. Really need to figure out a controller for this. Oh, I hate it when they hang up people like that. Makes me feel super uneasy. Well, all right.
so, so helpful. Okay, let's see if I can get that. <sighs> I hate those noises. Like, it's just what they sound like. Those noises over and over again. <gasps> it's what the doggy needs. Can I get it? Okay. Oh, we're gonna help the Mabari. Let's hurry up. Outpost. I want to try to find that stuff and return before I have to end the episode. Because, to be honest, it's getting pretty long, and I don't want these to be like hour long episodes, but it's kind of hard to get any games. So. Oh, what's gonna happen here? Is it gonna be a big fight? Chipmunks, and it's throwing me off so bad. It's like, am I supposed to be here in these chipmunks? Lovely. Oh, I think we found it. What have we here? <gasps> Are you a vulture, I wonder? A scavenger, poking amidst a corpse whose bones were long since cleaned? Or merely an intruder, come into these dark spawn filled wilds of mine in search of easy prey? What say you, hmm? Scavenger or intruder? Tis a tower no longer. The wilds have obviously claimed this desiccated corpse. I have watched your progress for some time. Where do they go, I wondered. Why are they here? And now you disturb ashes none have touched for so long. Why is that? Don't answer her. She looks chastened, and that means others may be nearby. Oh, you fear barbarians will swoop down upon you. Yes, swooping is bad. She's a witch of the wild, she is. She'll turn us into toads. Witch of the wilds. Such idle fancies, those legends. Have you no minds of your own? You there. Women do not frighten like little boys. Tell me your name, and I shall tell you mine. And you may call me Morrigan, if you wish. Shall I guess your purpose? You sought something in that chest? Something that is here no longer? 
here no longer. You stole them, didn't you? You're some kind of sneaky witch thief. How very eloquent. How does one steal from dead men? <laughs> Quite easily, it seems. Those documents are Grey Warden property, and I suggest you return them. I will not, for it was not I who removed them. Invoke a name that means nothing here any longer if you wish. I am not threatened. Twas my mother, in fact. Hmm. There is a sensible request. <laughs> I like you. I'd be careful. First it's, I like you. But then zap. Frog time. She'll put us all in the pot, she will. Just you watch. If the pot's warmer than this forest, it'd be a nice change. Follow me then, if it pleases you. Well, that was nice. I didn't expect to see more again so soon. Late. <sighs> oh dear, my game's not responding. Greetings, mother. I bring before you four grey wardens who I see them, girl. Hmm. Much as I expected. Are we supposed to believe you were expecting us? You are required to do nothing, least of all believe. Shut one's eyes tight or open one's arms wide. Either way, one's a fool. She's a witch, I tell you. We shouldn't be talking to her. Quiet, Dareth. If she's really a witch, do you want to make her mad? There is a smart lad. Sadly irrelevant to the larger scheme of things, but it is not I who decides. Believe what you will. And what of you? Does your elven mind give you a different viewpoint? What do you believe? Oh, if you must protest so quickly, perhaps I need not ask. So much about you is uncertain, and yet I believe. Do I? It seems I do. So this is a dreaded Witch of the Wilds. Witch of the Wilds, huh? Morrigan must have told you that. She fancies such tales, though she would never admit it. Oh, how she dances under the moon. <laughs> we did not come to listen to your wild tales, Mother. True. They came for their treaties, yes? And before you begin barking, your precious seal wore off long ago. I have protected these. You... Oh, you protected them. And why not? Take them to your Grey Wardens and tell them this Blight's threat is greater than they realize. Such manners. Always in the last place you look. Like stockings. Oh, do not mind me. <laughs> you have what you came for. Time for you to go, then. Do not be ridiculous, girl. These are your guests. Oh, very well. I will show you out of the woods. Follow me. <laughs> She's such a sassy girl, Morgan. When her mother's around, she's just a little, a little fussy. And she turns to a little nine-year-old girl she is on the inside. Here goes the game again. Ugh. Okay, it's back. Well, I think I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here. Yeah.
So I hope you guys liked it, and if you did, go ahead and hit like and subscribe, and if this dog does not shut up, Mabari, Mabari, be a rude. Okay, whatever. Alright guys, I hope you have a wonderful day, or night.